Hey guys, so like I said, my name's Kiana, and this is my sweatshirt collection. I'm really obsessed with sweatshirts, and um, I'm going to show you a few of my favorites. So I think I've decided that I'm going to try on my favorite sweatshirts only. Also, in no way am I trying to flex at all, I just collect sweatshirts. Some of them are more expensive than others, and they all vary in price. First, I'll start off with my Lululemon one. It was in my last haul, so I don't feel like I need to describe this one. It's just a cropped blue sweatshirt. Okay, next one, I love me some Brandy sweatshirts. They're like very well priced for like the best quality. They're so comfortable. And this one just says New York. I think I got it at the Brandy in New York. And this is just a gray crew neck and it says New York in green. I also have this hoodie from Brandy. It doesn't say anything, but I think it's really cool that there was like gray detailing and then it's just navy blue. It's super oversized and I love wearing it when it rains like in California like twice a year. Another Brandy find. I actually got this at the Brandy in Florida and it says Key West. So that's why I got it. It's just this huge crew neck. It's really oversized. Oh! also there's like pockets in it and I've never seen that in a brandy sweatshirt this is my first ever brandy sweatshirt okay I didn't really read it before I got it but it says Hellraiser so I didn't know that until I came home and I was like what does that say and then the back of it is just like this intricate dragon design I always feel really awkward when I stand up at school and then people see this and they're like wow this girl's super emo but super comfortable so I wear it anyways this is my Nike sweatshirt I just wear it when I work out and I like it because it's like a turtleneck kind of but there's also a hood attached this is actually like pretty cool because my friend made it it's just a tie-dye zip up because the tie-dye movement was huge this summer so I purchased a pink one next is um I went to Ariana Grande in October and we got her sweatshirt like the sweatshirt has a lot of dots on it and it's just like fuzzy it's a good sweatshirt just not like the best quality and it says break up with your girlfriend next sweatshirt is this army prince asphalt sweatshirt with a little rose on it such a good sweatshirt actually i've had it for a long time and i still wear it now and there's a rose on the back and it says asphalt again next sweatshirt because Duh, how could I not show this? Minnesota Vikings vintage sweatshirt. So cute. Like, oh, on the sleeve. I bought it at the team store in Minnesota. And they had this. And it was like a vintage Vikings comeback sweatshirt. It just, there's not a lot of like insulation on the inside. I got this sweatshirt. It's just champion. It's a crew neck. And it just says champion in purple. So I actually have a sweatshirt, just kind of like it, but it's orange and I actually did crop it. Super cute because I've never seen this orange color really anywhere. Also, the champion sign is like towel material. So that's cool. Next is my vintage champion from Urban Outfitters. Light blue turquoise -ish. Super comfortable super oversized just the sleeves are a little like cuffed on the end so I wish I got a bigger size but overall 10 out of 10 so like I said we went to Minnesota and I got this sweatshirt that says Minnesota and it's light gray so speaking of Minnesota and traveling I got this sweatshirt when I recently went to Aspen it just says Aspen like ski patrol next sweatshirt I have it's an Adidas and it's already cropped for me and then it says adidas on the front the three stripes i got this from jack's surf shop california people know what's up it's just the sweatshirt it says jack's right here it's tan on the topic of surf shops kind of when we were in hawaii last trip we stumbled upon this little vintage surf shop we found this sweatshirt and it says the endless summer hawaii in search of the perfect wave then on the back is the Endless Summer actual logo. And the inside is so fuzzy. It's the fuzziest sweatshirt I have. Mercedes-Benz sweatshirt. 
I don't even know why I have this sweatshirt. My uncle Bill is a huge like car guy and he took us to a Mercedes-Benz dealership. Well, I found this sweatshirt. It just has a Mercedes logo. Next sweatshirt is my Ethica sweatshirt. I got it actually on like Cyber Monday, I think. They're having a sale. It's just a simple green Ethica logo. This, I'm not going to like. This is the most comfy sweatshirt I have <laughs> ever purchased in my entire life. This sweatshirt, this is the first sweatshirt I have ever slept in. It is that comfortable. It doesn't even feel like it's cloth. It feels like silky in a way. I don't know. It's so comfortable though. 10 out of 10 recommend getting an Ethica sweatshirt. It's so worth it. So it is made by one of the members of Florida Georgia Line, the band. Tyler Hubbard and Brian Kelly are both the singers in Florida Georgia Line. And Brian Kelly actually makes his own clothing line with his wife. It's called Tribe Kelly. And as soon as they release the sweatshirt, they call it the Butter Sweat Collection. Um, it actually feels like butter. It's this black sweatshirt and it says Tribe in the middle. It is so soft on the inside. It is actually feels like butter. I would definitely invest in a Tribe Kelly sweatshirt. I like sweatshirts really oversized, but the medium fits me so well. Vintage Nike. It's just a black Nike crew neck, but it's cropped. The neckline though goes a little high for me. It's higher than a normal crew neck neck does. I got a size small and it fits really well. Essentials sweatshirt. X Fear of God. Everyone who like is really into sweatshirts knows about this brand. I wish though that I got it in a size smaller because I like oversized, but this is oversized. I got a size medium. Normally, like I get size mediums all the time and they fit me well, but this one is just, I'm swimming in this one. Um, it says essentials on the hood. Last sweatshirt. So Justin Bieber, he actually has his own brand called Drew and it's just a white Drew sweatshirt with the Drew smiley face on the front and it also says Drew on the sleeve. This sweatshirt's pretty big, so I'm just saying I got a size small and it's really oversized for me. It's pretty true to size, maybe even bigger. Really good quality sweatshirt. You guys, look at my bed right now. It's covered in sweatshirts. So thank you guys so much for watching. Like and subscribe.